What's going down, Molly Skyler fans? Ken through May area in the Maryland. It's great. Ugh. Anyway, I've got a somewhat different challenge today. Not really necessarily going to be a massive challenge. It is kind of in its own right massive, but it's different. I hit up Subway. They had two new subs, two baller subs, the Bacon Tatum and the Dre Potley Steak subs. I guess they're uh, kind of going after some basketball stuff going on down here. And here's what I did with them. I ordered, this, ordered this, uh, the sandwiches in the house. They would not let me record, but I did go double on every single thing they had there. All the veggies. I did put 15 different sauces on these sandwiches, salt and pepper, all those seasonings. I mean, everything. I put every single possible thing I could on these sandwiches. I didn't double up on the, the cheese and the proteins. I had double up what was actually supposed to be on there, but I didn't add. I, I don't really think they understood what I wanted because I was going to put every single possible thing on it. So I'll do that at a later date. But yes, it was a massive sandwich in its own right. So I've got two of those bacon and tatum and the Dre Poultley steak sandwiches. And then also in addition to that, on the way down the road, I did hit up Sonic and I'm going to try that new bacon jam burger. And of course I got to order tots because who doesn't order tots when they go to Sonic? So three sandwiches and an order tots. Not a massive thing. I mean, it's got a, it's, it's got some weight to it. I mean, I'd say this is probably eh, about five pounds, eh, four pounds, maybe. They're pretty decent size and they're going to be a hot mess when I take them out. But we'll see what we got. <laughs> So here are my sandwiches. I'm gonna actually unwrap them because they're gonna be a hot mess. And then, uh, yeah, just so you guys can kind of see what's going on here. So, bacon tatum and the Dre Poultly steak. Baller subs. All right. I actually don't know which one is which, so we're gonna say that. Um, <laughs> All right, like check this out. There's like, oh my gosh, they're so messy. There's so much sauce on each of these. Here are my two sandwiches. They're completely loaded with stuff. I'm gonna say about four pounds total for the sandwiches. They're a decent size. But like I said, I also got my bacon jam burger. And my Todd's right here. There's Todd's raw. <laughs> oh, there was a little candy in there. Oh, how sweet. All right, so. I'm not really into the candies, but here we go. So bacon jam burger, check this out. Uh, bacon, burger, I, I guess, here we go. The bacon jam's right there. Oh my gosh, it's messy. Uh, sloppy, drippy, yum. That, not very heavy, but I'm gonna go get some towels here. And I'll be All right, right, guys, I've got myself a towel here in case I, in case I drop a bunch of stuff. So like I said, I don't expect this to really take too horribly long. Um, I'm not trying to make a god-awful mess. Like, so this is about four-ish pounds, maybe four and a half pushing it. But like I said, it's the <laughs> the bacon tatum and the dre pulley steak. Uh, I think this is a steak one right here. And this one has to be the other one because it has steak on it. So 
Um, very loaded sandwiches. It shouldn't take too long. But I'll let you know how they are because I put literally 15 sauces on each one. All the veggies, I had to put extra veggies. They're a little bit wilted because they sat in the car for just a little bit. But obviously we know how that works. It's fresh, but dark on it. Every single thing does get wilted after a while. So here we go. Three, two, one. <laughs> Eat fresh. <laughs> oh God. Like I said, oh. Oh man. Same way, look at this. Oh my gosh. Not visual on that. every single vegetable. Look at that. Oh, 
not bad. It's not great. So, oof. So. I will definitely say that adding 15 sauces to any sandwich is not desirable. I know the ones I can remember off the top of my head. I have ranch, mayo, buffalo sauce, barbecue sauce, chipotle sauce, uh, vinaigrette, oil, red wine. Um, there was a sweet onion sauce. I mean, I, oh my gosh, just the combination. <laughs> it's kind of, ooh, a lot of vinegar on that. Um, it wasn't horrible though. Both those sandwiches are actually pretty good. They'd probably be pretty good or a lot better based on the way that they were made or supposed to be. So, you know, a little overwhelming with the vinegar on a lot of that. Bacon jam burger, I wasn't, it was good, but I, w I wouldn't buy it again. Uh, wasn't uh, the sweet bacony, eh, kind of tasted a little funky, but not bad altogether. So, kind of a food review slash food challenge. See what it would look like if I put all 15 sauces and everything on a sandwich. I'll come up with something a little bit better, but. Overall, not bad. Thanks for watching, guys. Like and subscribe. If you have any other ideas of things you'd like me to throw out there, let me know. I'm around, and uh, we'll see you next time with something either not impossible or just plain.